It is Saturday night. I just got back from the mall and I saw randomly a Robin. Um, Pac Photos posted earlier that he saw uh, the whole wave except for Poison Ivy at his GameStop in Virginia. So I popped into GameStop. If you see my breath, it is freezing in the toy garage. It is what it is. Uh, there's no heat in this thing, which is very difficult to film at night. So this is interesting. This is Robin from a movie that, you know, wasn't that great. But I'm in it for the toys. And I can't wait for that Build-A-Figure freeze. I actually like some of the designs from that film. It was very cartoony. Let me shut up. Let me open this Robin figure tonight on Toy Games. Hey! Oh! Games! So he comes with a card that has a nice picture of Chris O'Donnell. You know, Chris O'Donnell was supposed to be like the next Tom Cruise. It just didn't happen. Uh, I don't know if this film ruined his career or what. Um, truth be told, also, I love the Val Kilmer uh, Batman with Carrie and uh, Tom Tommy Lee Jones. And when this came out, I, it was such a joke. Uh, I actually left the theater... I want to see some girl that paged me. This was bad. I'm old, kids. Got that nice page. Was it 911 or something upside down? It just meant come take care of business. And I, I ran out of the theater because the movie wasn't good. I could watch that movie now and have fun with it. But he comes with some parts for Freeze that looks like it's going to encapsulate uh, Mr. Freeze. In the arms, I guess they are big. I'm kind of, I know this, this metal doesn't look that great, but you can just dry it, black wash it, and that'll look fine. I'm pumped for that figure. Now, the six pack Clooney has a cloth cape. I'm glad that in this wave they're back to plastic because a cloth cape without a wire in it is, is pointless. It really is. So the height in the movie, they were. Not that different in height. I think Clooney was a little taller. But there you have it. The suit does have the nips. That is a pretty good likeness to O'Donnell. I mean, it is what it is. You know, it's... Uh, if you hate the film, no one's going to buy this. But just the novelty of having a freaking uh, Batman and Robin action figure is really odd. Like I said, this this toy line, this last time this had a toy line by Kenner in the late '90s. I was collecting McFarlane. That's the I guess irony. I didn't collect the Kenner ones, but now here I am collecting the McFarlane ones. It was cold out here. I didn't feel like turning the heat onto the garage, so this is kind of silly, but I just wanted to show you that these are out. I'm all in. I don't know if that cape is a reuse. You got to give it to McFarlane. The capes look great. I know. Some of you hate them. We talked about this diaper earlier. When a diaper has a belt, it works perfect. I like this. Hope you do, too. Take care of fun. I'm freezing my nuts off.